Ladies and gentlemen, today we are becoming the scum of the earth and using a full defender team in EAFC. Now, I'm actually going to move Loftus Cheek in on the bench over Dante uh, because he is a midfielder. So, the player's base position does not have to be defense, it can be an alternate position, as for example, he should probably also go on the bench. This Grimaldo, as you can see, he can play left back, left wing back, left wing, left mid. He can play all the way down the left side, so he'd be eligible to play left mid in this formation. Loftus Cheek, for example, you can see he plays right back, sorry, right wing back. So he would be allowed to play centre mid. And this guy, while he is a left winger, does have left back as one of his positions. So we can use him as a sub. But we've somehow managed to find a striker who plays uh, in a defensive position as well. Now to start things off, we start off badly. And, um, you know, I was thinking, guys, I'm not stupid. I'm just going to use Cassias in goals. But no, we're committed. We are using a defender in goals. And the defender that we are using is Mr. Virgil van Dijk. Um, six foot four. At right wing back, we have we actually have a pretty attacking player. Because uh, I figured we've got all defensive players. We may as well get the attacking versions of the defensive players. Uh, and we've got Trent Alexander-Arnold in with a hunter. Now, you might have just seen a sneak peek at one of our centre backs. But we have this new card who I've packed, actually, who looks... Really bloody good. I'll put okay. I'll put Rio Ferdinand in. Well, there he is, <laughs> Diacate. Uh, he's the new player I packed. I think he looks really good for a centre back. So we're going to test him out. And the Bayer Evo. Uh, I've completed him since recording the full Evo team video. We're going to play him through the centre. Uh, actually, it should probably be Ferdinand because he's the slowest. At left wing back, we have a new icon who I've packed, um, and that is Roberto Carlos. Again, we're sticking with the theme of. The defensive plays we do have, we want them to be attacking because we know they can all defend. Um, I've whacked a dead eye on him. It's just what I have. Uh, he's going to be bombing down the left, hopefully, and uh, overlapping with our left mid, who is also a left back, if you couldn't already guess. Now, we've kind of scammed it with our two centre mids because at right centre mid, we have one of my favourite players, uh, a player I really like on this game as well, and that is Yozua Kimi. Now... Oh, yeah, could have used this Renard. Actually, no, I couldn't. She cannot play center back. Um, we're using Yozua Kimmich, and as you can see, he can play right back, so he's eligible to play center mid in this team. And the other center mid can play center back. And I've had him for a while now, and I never wanted to sell him because I thought, to, to be honest, I don't watch pro uh, tournaments at all. But maybe this guy's pro player is good. So we'll keep him in case he gets upgrades. We've gone with Mekengo. As you can see there, he can play center back. Guys, this this team, the main problem I don't think is going to be the shooting, but it's genuinely just going to be how unagile so many of these players are. And um, the player we are using is Marcos Llorente. He's fast. Um, that's about it. That's the only thing he's going to be good at for right wing or right mid. At left mid, it's probably someone you'd expect. He actually got signed as at Bayern. Uh to play left wing. He was meant to be the Ribery replacement, but he's ended up at left back replacing David Alaba. He's probably not even that bad of a left winger if we don't shoot with him. So we'll see how that goes. And you've seen him for a couple positions on the screen now at striker. It's pretty obvious who we have, I think. We just got to scroll down a little bit more to find him. And that player is, of course, Adama Traore. He can play right wing back. That's his base position. And I'm assuming he can play right back. No, he can't. He can only play right wing back. So, potentially a little bit of a fraudulent pick. But every player in this team can play in one of the defensive positions. Let's get on into the game. And it looks like we have found our first game. Um, fingers crossed this guy doesn't message me. Actually, that would be funny if he did. Go ahead, message me. We're probably going to get absolutely destroyed with Van Dijk in net. He is tall, though. That's the only positive about him playing in goals. Oh, my God, I need to turn the volume down. We're versing a person called Hehehe <laughs> Su. All right, okay, he's got a pretty mid sort of team. But he does have players with over 83 shooting, which I don't think we have a single player in the starting 11 with that. Okay, that's not a good start when we're already passing like that. And who would have thought? I was about to say the def 
full defensive team concedes within five minutes, but not just yet. All right, let's just play Adama in. Back into the middle. Ball roll. Get it to Davies. Step over. Oh. There's an opportunity there. Come on, we've got to win that header. Adama. Why did I do that ball roll? You know what? This might become a series. We might do uh, using a full midfielder's team, a full attacker's team, and then a full goalkeeper team. <laughs> let, me know, let me know what you guys would say to that. Whoa! It's definitely a foul. I think, honestly, the midfielder team would probably be okay, unless maybe I banned myself from using left mids and right mids, because I think that's kind of cheating. Like, I was debating whether I ban wingbacks for this video even. Oh, go on, Adama. Oh, what a finish. He's got 81 shooting, but that was an absolute rocket. I wanted to call it a thunder something, but I don't think YouTube likes that word. Oh, we've conceded to Orsolini while having 11 defenders in our team. I was going to say, where, what was the keeper doing as well? But you know what? I'm not going to hold it against him. Just remembered what's going on. Oh, my God. That was way too close for how... Shh, not going to say that. <laughs> how bad of a shot that was. Okay. Are we going to discuss that pass? Go on, step overs with Van Dyke. An interesting first half, to say the least. I think... I'm going to swap Roberto Carlos for Davies. Actually, no, I'm going to swap. I'm going to play Roberto Carlos at striker. Try away on the right. Davies on the left. And Lorente can sacrifice himself and play left back. Oh, I'm not getting control of the... That's a goal. Oh, are you joking me? Oh, go on, Kimmy. Step overs. Adama. Goal. Oh, he's... Oh, my God. What an emphatic finish that was. Well-worked goal as well. Oh, Kimmy, you got to win that. Oh, Yorente, you got to win that. Track the run. Yeah, we win that header every day of the week. Ah, oh, shit. No way that could... Oh, I'm like, yeah, I keep forgetting. We got Van Dyke in net. Like, this guy has not been uh, taking advantage of that enough. Goal. Oh, you donkey! Oh, Virgil Van Dyke. Like, I can accept not being able to make difficult saves, but how are you letting it go over you? You're taller than my normal goalkeeper. That's another goal. Never mind. We've got... Just over 10 minutes to get two goals. Do I think it's going to happen? Yes. Especially when we get our first one here. Told you. Okay, the first game ends a draw. Very frustrating. <laughs> On to the next game. Second game for today. And... Uh, we needed to take our chance against that last guy. He didn't have a great team. He wasn't the best player of all time. Um, I know it's not going to be the same this game. This is this is going to be a crazy player. He's got Loris. Uh, he's got that Evo. I've got Brian Zaragoza. It's not the most mental team ever, uh, to be completely honest. Like, if I see this in four champs, I go, oh, okay, cool. It's not, you know, not the worst. Try array. Terrible pass. McKengo. 1-0. Beautiful commentary. What more can I say? It's McKengo again getting forward. Finesse. Oh. Maybe if we had someone who wasn't a defender, uh, we could have scored there. Oh, he's cut in. And Van Dyke has jumped in the downward direction somehow. Oh, crap. Can't defend with a full defender team. Yeah, fair play. Good goal. That's not Trent. Oh, we've sat someone down. We've sat the keeper down. Smash it. 
Yes, Kimmich. No! I didn't green time it. Kimmich! Yes! It's a ratty goal with a ratty team. And it makes it 3-3 to us. We've got a chance yet again. We need a goal in the last 10 minutes. Is it going to be Roberto Carlos? It could be McKengo! 4-3 in the 84th minute. No. Everything is bouncing back to him. Two 4-4 four, four games. There's two ways of looking at it. You never lose when you use this much of a defensive team. Well, you never win. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.